Hi everyone and welcome to Wise Eyes. I'm your host, Sarah. And I'm Ethan, and today we want to talk to those with Casey who are thinking about getting iLink but are still unsure if it's the right move. Now look, we can understand hesitancy when it comes to having a medical procedure. I know I was hesitant. I mean, honestly, I didn't even want to think about it. But the truth is, keratoconus is serious, sight-threatening, and progressive. Absolutely. So, for anyone who's still on the fence, here are five reasons why you should listen to your doctor if they recommend the iLink cross-linking procedure. Number one, iLink is the only FDA-approved corneal cross-linking procedure to help slow or halt the progression of keratoconus and preserve your vision. Number two, without treatment, you may find that your vision continues to worsen, even with glasses or contacts, and you may require more expensive and invasive surgical treatments like a corneal transplant. To take it a step further, one in five patients who don't seek treatment may require a corneal transplant, and over half of those patients may require multiple transplants over their lifetime. Yikes, multiple transplants? No thank you. Number three, when cross-linking is done early or at a younger age, it's been shown that KC patients spend fewer years in advanced stages of KC and experience cost savings and improved quality of life. We definitely want this for you. Number four, slowing or halting the progression of KC with iLink can help preserve your vision. It may get worse without it. That's the bottom line. Mic drop. Wait, that was only four reasons. There's not five? Oh, I guess you're right. How about number five? If Ethan can do it, so can you. Very funny. <laughs> to answer any more of your questions and help turn your indecision into positive action, Glycos Patient Services, or GPS, is always available to help you on your keratoconus journey. And actually, that should be reason number five for getting out link. <laughs>